As the sun sets on another day, most of us are heading home to relax, unwind and prepare for what tomorrow has in store. But this group of adrenaline junkies is just ramping up. Taking the extreme sport of mountain biking to the extreme. They're hitting the track under the cover of darkness and it's not for the faint hearted. Traditionally a summer sport, mountain bikers are meeting weekly at Newcastle's Glenrock. I think for a lot of people that work late during the week it's just a chance to get out on days other than the weekend so just come up and throw the lights on and meet plenty of people when you're up here that are pretty enthusiastic as well so it's, it's really good. Uh, with night riding and having the lights it just makes things more accessible after work in winter. Battling nighttime chills for thrills. The move making an old track new again. I've ridden up here for a while and the first few times I came up night riding it was almost like you hadn't seen anything in here before, it was a brand new track. They've found dangerous obstacles, nocturnal creatures and even some new skills. Sometimes I, I, it's a bit weird, I actually find that I ride better at night. Um, when I sort of track my rides I can get personal bests, which I don't know how I do that, but yeah, I think my riding gets better. I think it definitely improves your reaction time. I think for the people getting into it, the best thing you could probably take from this is that the hills tend to seem a little bit smaller because you're not looking and seeing the whole hill in front of you. You're only really riding to the edge of your light each time. And age is no barrier. Is it addictive? Absolutely. Absolutely. As soon as you jump on the bike, you turn 14, so it doesn't matter how old you are, it's just uh, really good fun. At night, these riders can reach speeds of up to 50 kilometres an hour, but with the help of lights, it means they can see for up to 10 metres. We just make sure they have a light around 1,000 lumens in rating, one on the handlebar and one on your head. Main thing by having a light on your head is that you can look and have light exactly where you're turning your head towards, so a bit safer all round. Do people think you're crazy? No, I don't think so. No way. It's not crazy, it's fun. Christy Reading, NBN News.